Hey guys, it's Clara, and today I'm doing another haul. I know you guys are like, please stop hauling. Oh, um, this should be on my new channel, which is called Penthouse Pink, or Pink Penthouse. I should actually know the name of it. Um, behind the name, it's just a nasty nail polish that I like. And Sarah and my friend Sarah and I were like looking on all the nail polish names one time, and that was one of them. So I was like, hey, might as well be on a YouTube name. Um, so hopefully you guys have come from my last channel. If not, please go ahead and subscribe. I'm starting at like zero subscribers, so that's kind of scary. But yeah, let's get started on the haul. Um, in one of my previous hauls, um, back on my old channel, um, someone asked me to do like a close-up so they could actually see the stuff, so I will be including that in this video. So don't worry, it will be there, so you'll be able to like see everything I got. Um, so we're going to go ahead and start with kind of the less exciting stuff. First I got a Camel water bottle. Everyone always raves about these. They're like, ah, I drink so much more water. Oh, Camel. And of course, I'm going to break it. But yeah, so I got a Camel water bottle. Um, I think this is called the Eddy. It is called the Eddy. Um, I got it in purple because all the other ones you could see, like, they just look like they you could see the scratches on them more. And I like to throw my things around. So I think this one will work well. It was like 15 bucks, which I think is good. Um, I'll use it a lot. I... <laughs> I'm obsessed with like water bottles and things like that. You can ask my friends. I'm like, what? I'm like always like trying to like buy them. So I've probably spent like $50 in my life on like water bottles, which is sad, but I really like this and I know I'm going to use this because I just want one that I can clip to my backpack for school. Um, I can just take with me everywhere and it won't spill because I, I'm really clumsy, if you couldn't already tell from me, like, throwing my bottle on the floor. So, I'm really going to like this. I just hit myself in the face with it. And it says it's got a got your back lifetime guarantee. Don't know what that means, but that looks cool. And I just think it's really cute. Um, then I'm going to go into, like, some cutesy stuff I got at a little boutique. Oh, if you guys didn't know, I was in Estes Park, Colorado. We go there um, quite a bit, just to, you know, visit. It's a beautiful place. Um, and one of the girls actually commented on a previous video. I like how I keep talking about all these other videos that I've done. Oh, stay in the present, Clara. And she was like, I live in Colorado. I go to Estes all the time. So that was so exciting. I wish we would have been there the same week so we could have, like, hung out or something. But you guys, if you guys are ever, like, where, like if I tell you where I'm going to be and you guys are going to be there, please come say hi to me would be so cool so I'm gonna show you what I got um we went down to this place called Glen Haven um to get sandwiches and there was a little boutique 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 next to it um and so I just picked up a couple things for like friends and these are actually like I could totally make this myself so if you guys want to see like a DIY DIY video tell me just look at it it's really cute it's got like sequins and this is um a little gift box and then it says this box has been lovingly hand decorated using a recycled container. Perfect for that special little something gift. So this is really cute, you know, we put earrings in or little gifts for friends or whatever. She don't know what she wants to be. All the pictures in the magazines. Holding hands when she's mad at me. She don't want and I just I loved it. Um it was like five dollars, which isn't bad. Then I got two bath oh whew, fizzy bath balls and this one I'm obsessed with it reminds me of like a Tiffany's box in ball form it's just so so pretty um love love it and I've never actually tried a bath fizzy but I'm gonna try it and then I got this one and they look like owl pears or something and it's so cute it even came with instructions fizzy bath ball just put in bath what who knew you're supposed to put this in your bathtub so I got those and those were like I want to say five dollars each as well then I only got two more things from this little boutique, and these are bath pearls, and they're really cute. They do look like little pearls, and they're in these little cute containers, and I'll probably give these to friends, and I might keep one for myself just because they're really cute, and I kind of want to try them. Don't judge. Oh, they, they smell like kind of good actually and so I just think these are going to be nice for like taking baths and relaxing and all that fun stuff and these were three dollars a piece and these are just cute little gifts to add with like a birthday gift you know and it's something no one else is going to be giving them so I like those I'm saving my 
my most anticipated stuff for last. Then I got a wolf shirt. I don't know if any of you guys watch Cast MG, but if you do, you know he's always, always wearing a wolf shirt. Like in every video, he's wearing a wolf shirt. So my best friends there and I were in Colorado and we are like, oh my gosh, we have to get wolf shirts because like, sorry, I'm like picking my eye, that's disgusting, but itches. And like every store window, there were shirts with like wolves on them, like intense, like creepy looking wolves. I'm personally like... I didn't buy it because I thought it was cute. I bought it because it's hilarious. I'm going to wear it all the time because it's actually pretty cool. So just, I'll show you the back first because there's nothing on it and I want it to be surprised. It's like neon yellow. Like bright yellow. And it's long sleeve, which is kind of a bummer. I should have gotten short sleeve because where I live right now, it's like 110. Why are my friends texting me so much? So this is the front. I got it in medium. <laughs> and here are the wolves on it hoping you guys can see and then down here it says S is Park Colorado because that's where I was and so it's it's kind of cute I know it's not but it's hilarious I'm gonna wear it all the time with like high-waisted shorts and stuff and it's got wolves on it so I feel like Cass G now so if you guys like you guys should go to Cass G's video and be like go watch this video she bought a wolf shirt and yeah so that's what I got then I got two books, and, like, I, Estes is more of, like, a touristy kind of place where you're kind of supposed to buy touristy stuff, but I go there quite a bit, so I was like, why not buy cookbooks? Um, I got two. One was $15 and one was $20. Oh, the shirt was $15, by the way, which wasn't bad. And these say the word diet on them, and I know when a lot of people see them, they're like, oh, my God, you don't need to be on a diet? Ew, why are you doing that to yourself? You shouldn't have to worry about what you eat. You're only 17. Like, that kind of stuff, guys. I promise I'm not going on a diet or anything. I want to eat healthier. Because I eat, like, pizza, chicken, chips. That's, like, my life. Pizza, chicken, and chips, and pasta. Like, so I just wanted to read, like, someone else's, like, perspective on how to eat. And so I got this one. It's called Chris's... It's by Chris Carr, and it's Crazy Sexy Diet. Including a 21-day adventure cleanse. I've been wanting to go on a cleanse just to try it, guys. I'm not, like going all diet on you or anything. I just thought that this would be, like, something interesting. And it's so interesting. It just talks about, like, what kind of stuff you're putting into your body, what you should shouldn't be eating. And it has a section on animals. And I'm not a vegetarian or anything, but after reading that section, I was definitely like, maybe I should reconsider. But it's just a really interesting book that talks about, like, juicing and all that kind of stuff and just ways to eat better. This lady had, like, a form of cancer that was uncurable. She was destined to die you know in the next eight years or something so she wanted to change her lifestyle because she ate terribly she ate like fast food all the time so she you know um became she went to college or school to become a health nutritionist or whatever and she started eating like she's a vegan so she's cut out all animal products and all like dairy products and now you know seven years later her cancer is inactive she still has the cells because she can't get rid of it but it's inactive, and she's healthy, and I just thought it was really interesting. And I'm definitely not going to, like, go full on, I'm a vegan now or anything, but I do want to incorporate some of these things into my lifestyle, and I just think it's kind of interesting. So I'm not going on a diet, don't worry. I just thought that this would be really interesting because I really like reading stuff about healthy eating and that kind of stuff because I don't know a lot about it, and a lot of the labels anymore, like, this is healthy, this is healthy, blah, 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 made with real fruit. And it's like all this processed crap. And I kind of want to cut out a lot of that from my, from my, you know, daily food diet. So I thought that was interesting. And to go with it, I got, this is by Jansen Manheim. The Healthy Green Drink Diet. Advice and recipes to energize, alkalize, lose weight, and feel great. Um, alkaline, like, if you guys know what a pH scale is, if you're taking chemistry, you'll know. Um, there's the acidic side. This is for in your body. There's an acidic side and an alkaline side. And you want to be more on the alkaline side than you do on the acidic side. And to do that, you need to be eating lots of vegetables and things like that that um, have a pH more on the alkaline side. And that's what it means by alkalize. And it just, this is really cool. It's got like blending benefits versus juicing benefits. Um, because I don't own a juicer and those are pretty expensive. So I kind of want to start with like blending to see if I like, if I like it before I go out and buy a juicer. Because if I'm not going to drink the juice, then I don't need to buy a juicer. 
Anyway, so it comes with like recipes and they, they look kind of nasty, but I'm interested and I really want to try it. I figure if I have one of these a day, like for breakfast or something, because I don't really like breakfast anyways, I think I can be a lot healthier. I'm not looking to lose weight or anything like that. I just want to be healthy. The place I got these is called Omnibus, so if you're ever in SS Park, stop there. They've got really cute jewelry. It was $15 if I didn't already say that. And they're just little studs and they're anchors, which I thought was really cute. And I think they're sterling silver, which is always plus. Then, the final thing in my haul, which is kind of like the most exciting thing for me, I got um, a new pair of glasses. I wear contacts and glasses, if you didn't know that. And my glasses were just like, I had them since like 6th grade. They were ready to go. I wanted a new pair. Um, and I got these today, so not really on vacation, but that's okay. Ooh, the hiccups. And they are by Kate Spade. And this is like, is this not the cutest glasses case ever? It's like, two. T oh, I have the hiccups. Sorry. It's like two-toned with like blue and then green, and it's just... Kate, anything by Kate Spade is just adorable. And so I got these, and I found out my friend Sarah, she's got a pair of Kate Spade glasses, and I was like freaking out. I was afraid we were going to have the same glasses. But we have different tastes, so thankfully we don't have the same glasses, because that would have been awkward. And it's got the like seeing eyes in the background, which is cute. Um, and these are them. I haven't like gotten my lenses put in yet, so that's why um, it still says Kate Spade on them. But I really like them. I think they're just kind of like chic looking and they just I feel smart um I don't know comment below and tell me if you guys like them um these were I want to say like 146 I mean any more lenses I mean glasses frames are that around that price so I mean I'm gonna wear them a lot I really like them they're really cute the sticker still on them and that's sticky so yeah these are them so please expect to see these in days where I don't feel like trying because like I haven't worn glasses like I've been wearing my contacts like, every day all summer and all year because my glasses were so out of prescription I like couldn't even see out of them so it'll be nice to have glasses that I can see out of because when driving it'll just be nice to throw on my glasses on my lazy days and I think they're cute so yeah that is everything I got um this is my new channel so welcome this might or might not be the first video I post um, comment below suggestions you want to see and you have to subscribe guys please well you don't have to but I would love it like I seriously would love it if you would subscribe just because like <sighs> I care about making videos that people want to see and I just want you guys to be able to see them whenever so by subscribing you make me happy and you get updated when my videos come out I love you guys and I see you, I'll see you later bye oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh.